I'm Pastor George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. The Lord is tempted for us to save us. That's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. So often, we hear every single year, first Sunday in Lent, is the temptation of our Lord. He goes out into the wilderness. He is driven out into the wilderness by the Spirit, still dripping with water from his baptism. How much like us is he? Into temptation, to be tempted by the devil. He fasts for 40 days. That's called doing a Lent. And then he's hungry. And he's greeted by the devil, who says to him, If you are the Son of God, command these stones to become bread. That's rather sort of sensible. You're God. You can do this. And the Lord responds, you shall not live by, uh, uh, man shall live by bread, not by bread alone, but by every word that comes forth from the mouth of God. So the devil takes him up to the pinnacle of the temple and says, you could Peter Pan off the top of the temple, Jesus. And, and the scriptures say you shall command the angels concerning him. He'll lift you up and catch you lest your feet strike the stone. So says the scriptures, Jesus. And Jesus says, you shall not test the Lord your God. And so, last, the devil takes him to the top of a high mountain, shows him all the kingdoms of the world, and says, all this I will give you if you bow down and worship me. It's like uh, John Lovitz way back in the day, before your time, showing my age. And the Lord says, get behind me, Satan. Uh, you shall worship the Lord your God, and him only shall you serve the devil departs, and Jesus is ministered to by the angels. Now, this is not a guide to overcome temptation. Oh, see how Jesus uses the word to drive the Satan off. If it is, it's not primarily a guide to overcome temptation. This is about your salvation. This is about round two. All right? Round one, Adam versus Satan. Round one goes to Satan. Food. First temptation, does Adam in? Don't you want to be like God? Second Adam goes into the wilderness to, to, to go one-on-one -on -one with the serpent. At stake is yours and my salvation. If Jesus goes under, we're lost. Sin entered the world through Adam, but salvation and grace and truth comes through Jesus. If Jesus falls... If Jesus falls into sin, we're goners. And so to watch this titanic battle is to watch our salvation. He is faithful for us. He isn't, he isn't, he doesn't succumb for us. And we have a Savior who has undergone every temptation that is common to men and went through it for our comfort, for our good. And the last temptation is the one I think this is the, is the key to this. The last temptation is you can have it all, just don't die for them. That's really what's going on. Don't put them first, Jesus. You can have it all. You can skip right to Matthew 28. You don't have to do the other 27, uh, the other 21 chapters. Go right, go right to the end of the book, Jesus. All you got to do is bend the knee to me. To send the devil away is Jesus saying, I'm going to do it the way my father wants me to. I'm going to go through the cross to save them. To save them, I'm going to die. And then I'll rise again. And then everything, all authority on heaven and on earth will be given to me. But it'll be the Calvary and Easter way rather than your way. We should turn from our sins. We should give them up. We should run from them. We should not think that temptation is, is something that, that we can just give in to. We should learn from Jesus to overcome temptation. We should run to him in times of temptation and testing. And we should, But all the more we should believe that he was tempted for us to save us. And he was faithful even unto death, death on a cross. 
This is about Jesus for you beating Satan. This is about your salvation's achievement. And in this, you're hearing it, that salvation is delivered to you in word, in water, in body and blood. Your life now in Christ is lived dripping in the waters of your baptism, repenting of your sins, and believing in Jesus. That's Lent. Jesus for you. Saving you. I'm Pastor George Borgard, and this is another Higher Things video.